Hey everyone, Will here with my flea market finds for May 22nd, uh, 2019. A little late getting out this video, but uh, um, some neat stuff to show you this week. Uh, it was uh, a ton of yard sales uh, this past weekend. Um, got some neat stuff to show you. Uh, let's take a look. Uh, take a look. This is all, got this all from one spot. I uh, went to yard sale and the guy, um, first thing I noticed is this Black & Decker Workmate. Um, it's the good kind with the uh, cast frame, not the stamped uh, metal frame. So I know right away that is a uh, around $120 uh, Workmate. I asked the guy how much. He's like, nothing in my spot is more than five dollars he's like oh, you can have it for five dollars so i grab it set it off to the side and i start making a pile and at the end of it i asked him how much he's like how about 15 bucks so i paid 15 dollars for everything here new dewalt uh shirt a uh, pizza john hat um, of course the Black & Decker uh, Rawlings uh, glove brand new uh, Franklin glove brand new a uh, drafting set a nice little uh, uh, is that the block or the tackle um, one of those neat little uh, live trap Hearts, heart, ideal tie wire reel, uh, Mitchell spinning reel, it's in there, uh, cane, African, hand carved, it was a good uh, weekend for canes, and uh, check this out, it's a, uh, Bose, I guess you set your uh, little iPod or something in there, uh, clean it up a little bit. It's missing the adapter, but it should be, should be easy to find one. You need a 20 volt uh, DC adapter, but uh, if that works, that's going to be a great piece. So everything here, $15. Uh, no telling what that will end up being uh, once we get it all sold. Uh, let's see, uh, 250 somewhere around there. Uh, motorcycle jacket. Don't know anything about motorcycle stuff. Um, said it was an expensive one. I got it for ten dollars. It's at the time you put like the armor plates in. There's a couple of them in here. Uh, same guy had bought his son a helmet and he only wore it a couple times and outgrew it. Uh, this is a Scorpion air pump, but it's extra small. Uh, but uh, got that for eight. Uh, he said that was like a couple hundred dollar helmet in itself. Got a uh, military helmet liner, 50 cents on that. Uh, healthy uh, nailer, finished nailer, uh, 10 bucks on that. A uh, bicycle seat, not sure what it's to, but it's old uh, banana seat bike. Uh, made in Italy, so it's got to be a good one. Uh, we'll have to look that up. A dollar. Um... Not quite sure what it is, but uh, it's too cool to pass up. Uh, can't go wrong buying unique stuff. Uh, marked on the back, AJ Gallagher. Be a good starting point to try to uh, look this up and see what it is. Uh, eight bucks on the set. Got a uh, flute, all nicely carved. Got to be a flute player, collector out there that would want this thing. Uh, three bucks on that. A little telescope. Kind of a novelty item, 
uh, $12 on that. Cool looking. Love the old uh, Marbles uh, oil can. Uh, that was a dollar. McDonough School uh, belt buckle. That was uh, five bucks. Uh, carved wooden nutcracker. Uh, got it for 12. Star Trek model. I uh, got that for two bucks. It's still uh, in the original uh, package in there. Uh, that's about a $15, 20 piece. Uh, hand carved wooden box full of uh, chopsticks. Uh, ten, got that for eight. Uh, these go around a horse collar. Um, I think they're called hams. Might be saying that wrong. Uh, $5 a set for those. Uh, some neat uh, drink holders. Western theme. Never seen those before. Uh, $7 for a uh, set of five. Somebody uh, that likes Western themes will uh, do well with that. A couple of uh, Steve um puppets uh paid 30 for a pair of those uh love the flask is that cool looking or what four bucks it's got a hole but for a display piece uh, that is very cool uh wind song by prince machiavelli uh six bucks on that Old pen, four bucks. Trafari pen, three. Coro for three. Some Scot real Scottish plumes. A uh, set of three of them. Something to do with a uh, uh, kilt, I guess. I have to look him up. A little sterling uh, pendant. Uh, that was uh, five bucks on that. The little pin is neat, five bucks, and the little, you can see the bird, he's on a spring, pretty cool. Uh, very 1950s, uh, mid-century modern uh, necklace, that was five. Uh, they call these uh, jelly bellies, uh, that was five for the set of them, little turtles. Love the knife, it's a, uh, I forget now, I think it's a Remington. Um, yeah, it's a Remington. It uh, could be very collectible. Um, made for uh, Hanover shoes. Uh, nice pocket knife. Uh, 15 on that. Chanel number no. 5 box. Uh, an empty bottle. I uh, love the old perfumes. Look at this. Uh, from Paris. And right on there. To Bernice. From Roy. Merry Christmas. And uh, it's three little bottles that the perfumes came in. Just a cool piece. Um, that was ten. Uh, some tools. I have a pair of these for my, myself. Uh, wire strippers. They work really good. Um, brand new. Still in the pack. Uh, five bucks. Also five bucks. Craftsman uh, needle nose pliers. Uh, probably end up keeping those myself. Always need needles, needle nose pliers. Uh, some replacement parts, 50 cents. Uh, these are for a uh, trailer hitch um, to uh, replace the worn out parts on a trailer hitch. Uh, check these out. A uh, guy was asking eight bucks a piece. I got all three for uh, 20. And these are uh, impact duty uh, drill bits, still in the orig original box. Guy must have got these from his work or something. Uh, but uh, on eBay, they're going for between 20 25 a piece. There's three of them here. Nice, uh, easy to do quantity listing. Um, through the Looking Glass, nice old book, 
couldn't find a date on it, but it looks late 1800s, early 1900s by uh, Lewis Carroll. Uh, seen better days condition-wise, but uh, good book. Pike and Cutlass, Hero Tales of Our Navy. Uh, this was uh, 1912. Uh, African Genesis first edition took a shot on it since it's a first edition five bucks and uh, Heidi book uh, from 1919 nice graphics uh, check out the piece of driftwood that looks like a fish is that cool or what even uh, kind of see an eye here top fin tail uh, cool piece uh, five bucks on that. Uh, somebody could help me out. I think it's a game. Um, something Hebrew. Um, got a, like some leather straps and a little ball on it. Not quite sure what that's all about. But uh, five bucks couldn't pass it up. A uh, little paper cutter. Vintage. Somebody's going to want a nice old paper cutter. Love how they, uh, look how they join that together. Dovetailed it. Instead of just gluing or nailing it uh, on, they took the time to uh, dovetail that. Don't see that kind of quality uh, anymore. Uh, $4 on that one. Uh, got this for uh, eight little, he's a knotter. Not quite sure. Knotters have done well for me. Um, kind of an ugly one, but uh, uh, we'll see what that brings. Uh, a couple of canes. This one is neat because it also doubles as a seat. I just fold that down like that, and mm, needs a little WD-40 on there. Not much of a seat, but if you got nowhere to sit, uh, that'll do the job. And one of my favorites, it looks African to me, not quite sure, but turn a little doll here and then pull it out, and it's a sword. So. Not something you can sell on eBay, but uh, I think that's going to end up in uh, in my own collection. Um, cool piece. A uh, street map of uh, San Francisco. Maybe we can find a year on it somewhere. Couldn't find one. But uh, nicely framed. Uh, that was eight pair of uh, shoes for my son got these for four bucks um, they look lady said they were only uh, worn one time I believe her um, but uh, it's gonna keep me from buying my son a brand new pair um, so that's quite the savings right there uh, and then <laughs> I paid thirty dollars for everything here um, it's all medical supplies, uh, tubing and such. Um, here's a whole bunch of airway tubing. More, uh, stuff. Some of this stuff on eBay goes for like, just this pack here goes for like $15, $20. And I have multiple packs of them. Different kinds. Here's some swab sticks. Got uh, like six boxes of these. Uh, we'll sell these in quantity. Um, just uh, pretty cool. Uh, shipping won't be too bad on these. And uh, um, listing shouldn't be too bad either. I mean, they got the uh, got the model number on here. And uh, it tells you exactly what it is. Brand new in package. Um, so, kind of unusual, but uh, should do well. Uh, 
a lot of listening. But it uh, should be fun to see uh, once it gets uh, up and running. Uh, so keep an eye on my store, Terminal 99, which is where most of the stuff will be appearing over the next few days. So until next time, this is Will Yard Sales Survivalist, and we'll talk again soon.